Hi everyone, it's Graham from Lakeside and uh, just a very very quick video um, and it's primarily, to be honest with you, um, a test um, video to see what my new laptop here uh, performs like. Um, I've got a fair way done with the dismantling of Lakeside as you can see. Um, so it used to come out to here and this used to be the high rise section and the terminus uh, running along here and that's my main lines going through there um, and as you can see that's all now gone um, the fiddle yard not the fiddle yard the TMD area is gone all the buildings etc are lifted up um, over here this front section here is now gone so the terminus used to actually come to here about there um, and the main building was about here so that's all stored away um, and I've got a few bits of wood left over which I will use but mainly all this lot will be dumped and new MDF used. Um, so if we go around here, you can see that that part of the scenic here is now gone but it's saved and I've managed to save all the scenery right up to over there so I can reuse that and if you look right at the very end just there where my finger is um, that's another section of scenery which I've managed to save as well so I managed to save quite a bit. I've saved the platform so far. There's no reason why I shouldn't be able to save the remaining ones there. Um, all that track will be dumped. I'm not going to be using that, but I will be saving all the points. But the main track, I'm not going to take any chances on that with a new layout. I'm just going to put new new track down. Um, so that's basically how far I've got at the moment. It's going quite well. I'm not rushing it. I'm taking it up gently so that I'm not destroying virtually anything apart from the track. Um, and even then there are little bits which I'm saving. But the vast majority will be dumped, which is that lot there. Um, right. The laptop, this is what's been giving me the group over the last few days my old laptop which was I got in 2011 um, was a lovely uh, laptop it really served me well it's a 17 inch model unfortunately Apple don't do the 17 inch anymore they only do maximum of 15 inch which is actually it's fine um, and it's surprising how quickly I've got used to it um, what I've done I've bought this which is a a imitation book cover if you like so from the outside it looks like a, a leather bound book um, which is really nice it's a good protective sleeve for it and i had that on my previous uh, laptop so if you open it up just like any other laptop you see to be honest with you uh, this is a 15 inch macbook pro it's got a function bar across the top here which is touch driven and LED lit so you can drive a lot of the functions from that bar but the nice thing about it what I really like is the connectivity of it um, incredibly quick um, and this is one of the reasons for the video is because I want to test this camera out um, importing a video I did a quick test on an old video I had um, well, an old video last week when I made it it took 40 minutes to download onto the laptop um, download from the camera to the laptop this one it took four minutes it is blisteringly quick and to show you give me an example if I boot up Photoshop there it is there's no clunk, 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 opening, blah, 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 blah. It's just there. And likewise with iMovie. Bish bosh.
I mean, that is quick. That is really quick. Um, and primarily it's because it's got an SSD drive in it rather than the ordinary spinning disk type hard drive which my other laptop had. Um, so it's all solid state. So I'm hoping that when I put this video up it's going to be up within minutes rather than an hour which is what it was taking me. Um, so this is really just purely a test to be honest with you and to show you what's happening up here. So it is getting underway. I was hoping to have all this down by this weekend, but because of this thing, I've been held up trying to sort this out. Um, but <clears throat> no rush. Even if it takes me another week, that's fine. So the next thing to do on here is, as you can see, I've got all the locos stored in their boxes along here and underneath that shelf, plus I've got the coaches as well and I've still got some coaches to pack into boxes so I've got to remove all this lot from here and store those somewhere while I take this down. Um, that's really the next stage because I'm getting to that part now where I need to start taking this top layer off. So that's where we're at. Okay so that's all for now. Um, I just want to give you a quick update of what I was doing and why I haven't really done too much on this which has been mainly due to that okay so I'm going to go and upload this now and see how long it takes okay so bye for now and uh, hopefully I'll speak to you again soon okay so bye